afternoon. Good afternoon, guys. You see, we got our nice little garden over there. Yeah, I'm loving it. And we got some corn. Good afternoon. There's all green. Still here. I know it looks blue. Still here, but that's not the focus of today's video. The focus of today's video is going to be Project Full Weaver. See, look at the dog over there. It's going to be Project Full Weaver. We uh, broke the carburetor, we want to say. And it's. Well, I'll show you. This is just going to be like, I plan on this being a short four minute video so I can quick upload it and not take three hours like the last video. And nine minute video took three hours to upload. Yes, my internet was slow. And I'm sorry about the camera angle on that last video, guys. I'm recording the same exact way. Different phone, same way. There's Project Full Weaver. There's Arctic Cat. Um, the cat. I have broke the transmission on it, but it still runs and drives. It drives just not well. Let's just say that. Because it clicks and stuff. Well, let's show you what we kind of did here. Who needs gas tank nowadays, anyways? So, do you see this? Uh, let it clear, clear up. That red deal in there. Let's clear this up. There's gonna be a pin. Well, that pin goes in this this wire right here. Well, we, me and my dad, who helped me work on this, broke it. So what we're planning on doing is we're planning on soldering this with this and soldering it together. And then butt connect it so we have a carburetor. Because if y'all don't remember, I'm not sure if any of y'all actually watched the old video. But this was our old boot. And I just found the old gasket and stuff. I'm glad. It's needed. So yes, that's also, and I also redid the carburetor, the um, throttle cable. Our, or, we ordered the right one of those with the boot. That's a brand spanking new boot made Japan with the new deal. It took about a week for three parts to come in. Not bad. They did go all over the world, but you know, wasn't bad. Just wanted to give y'all a little update. Y'all will know when this thing fires up because it won't be the first time being on YouTube. But when we ever get started, that next day I'll come out and I'll do a recording of it running. Uh, yeah, just giving y'all a quick update. Try not to, because I know it'll take forever. But these shocks are shot, as you can tell, stepping. And yes, I know if I sound weird, I'm sorry. I just want to give a shout out to, to New York for helping me do my edits. Teaching me how to. And to everybody who watches this video. That it still broke. We just got the part in for it, but the full this full weaver has been to the hell with me. But um, there's a CV joint in here that is broke, not that one, or something that's broken the transmission. Sort of is what I was told. I don't know how much it's going to cost me to fix that full lever. That's how it sits. But project full lever still working. I'm still working on it right now. I um, started to remove the timing cover. And I uh, accidentally popped a hole in it. So I got to try to fix that. If any of y'all have any ideas on how to fix this hole. A rigging. Please drop it in the comments and I will like and see that. And please share my videos. But. Tell there's my timing belt. It is loose. I'm not sure if you can tell. It's loose. Uh, sometimes the transmission don't want to work, but right now it is. It's only going to reverse, not want to go in the high, and it does that from time to time. Both light works, and believe it or not, I've had this thing for almost three years now and haven't heard it run. Uh, I was told it's set for ten years. Before that. But I don't know about that. I can't verify it. But I know I'll set for at least three. So.
so yeah that's just a quick update I'm going over my five minute limit I gotta go try to upload this on my computer hopefully it goes on my computer I hope um, tires are ball these are doing good I got some that's the type of tires I'm gonna try to get on here I'll make this in my yard got this um, we start clearing out we want this back our full acre almost that boat still don't run and that we we can't get a title for it. Um, we do have one more vehicle that I'm not showing y'all and I can't because it's up in Dallas and it's kind of rusty as heck right now so it's not worthy of being shown anyways until we get to working on it and fix it but this one runs shifts through all the gears well low you have to keep coming up and then then it'll go into low it's pain in the butt but it goes in the low this one same can't be said got a little rusty frame but you know what for a free full weaver can't beat it i can't wait to get it running drive it out and give it a wash video and give it its first wash and lord knows how long and ironically check this tow hitch out <laughs> there's tow hitch built in that's lovely uh, instead of putting the key, we went toggle switch. We just thought it'd be better off. I kind of like it. I think it's pretty cool. But I agree with this saying right here. If you take care of your tools, your tools will take care of you. And that's my dad's saying. He, he inflicted that saying into me from day one. From the day I was born. Just a quick update video. It's just a quick update video. Um, hope y'all have a great day. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe if you haven't already. Because you're missing out. Shout out to all y'all. Have a blessed day. Adios.